Hey, what's up guys, Marcus here. Okay, so today I'm making this video to settle a debate. So, apparently for a long time since we were kids, me and a friend have been arguing about the potential or possibility of dodging the blue shell in Mario Kart. Not only am I gonna tell you that dodging the blue shell is possible, I'm also going to show you footage of me successfully dodging blue shells in Mario Kart, specifically Mario Kart DS. Now how this is done? Well, basically what you do is when you hear the blue shell coming, you do a power slide. And when you do a power slide, right as the shell is about to hit you, you hop. LRR. And then once you hop, you dodge the blue shell. So, to settle this debate, I'm going to show you these clips of me dodging the blue shell to end this once and for all. Rayon, this is for you. Alright, so this is the first dodge. So, I'm currently, you know, racing and power sliding to speed around these corners. And once I hear that the blue shell is coming, I kind of step into a power slide to make sure I can dodge it. So as it hits, you know, I'm just going to hop. So you see me like power sliding and hopping, boom, blue shell dodge number one. And I'm going to actually loop it right now. So like you can see the blue shell there and you see just as I hop, I escape that whole blue shell area. So playing it back one more time, blue shell comes, I hop and I dodge it. So it's important to see this now because Depending on the angle, because you know I can only record this from the replays, it may not show the hop and then the dodge. So like for example in this with Yoshino, it looks like I just slid through but I literally hopped but the camera angle didn't show me dodging it properly. But yeah, that's how it's done. I'm going to show you some more. So here's one of my favorite characters, Bowser, very very fast. I'm power sliding around corners, the blue shell is coming, I hear it coming, and I slide into a power slide right here and BOOM! Hop and dodge again. I'm gonna slow that one down. I mean, honestly, you have to be like a really, really skillful Mario Kart player to even do this. So, I mean, it's some high level stuff, but it is possible. Because once you can time, like I said, you power slide and then you hop as it drops, you know, over time, like, you know, you, you basically kind of lose the race because, you know, you dodge blue shell. Alright, so let me show you another example. Uh, what's actually cool in it is like sometimes you can use the environment to help you dodge a blue shell and I mean this is usually coincidental because you can't dictate where a blue shell will appear or when but I mean I heard a blue shell coming and I know that like in this stage you have like this hyper speeding boost jump thing so I said yo let me try and reach that um, before the blue shell comes because I couldn't really pause like because I'm in a straightaway and then as I hit it boom I missed the blue shell so that's like a buck ups blue shell dodge but yo it's another way to dodge a blue shell and yo, I really love this blue shell dodge I recorded because, you know, this was actually technically difficult to execute. So the blue shell is coming, I hear it coming, I'm coming around the corner, and there are these two vehicles in a way, I power slide between the vehicles and dodge the blue shell. Come on! And there you can see the same technique. Moving on! So this one with Donkey Kong, same thing, boom! Blue shell dodge. And again, like I said, because this is from the replay, sometimes you can't see the hop. And here's another one, me using uh, is that Waluigi, power sliding around the corner, crushing it, killing it, you know, running it, and boom, picture perfect blue shell dodge. And uh, what's funny is I recorded this years ago, and just had a conversation on Facebook which made me make this video. <laughs> and this next video is really interesting because I dodged two blue shells in succession. Um, because you know sometimes when, when you're like way ahead the computer starts to cheat so like hit you with one blue shell and then another blue shell comes from another character but I was kind of surprised that two blue shells came like within like you know 30 seconds and I successfully dodged both of them because especially in like places like this now you know I'm always power sliding around corners and I just hop when the blue shells come so I'm gonna show you both dodges so this is the first one here and I'm saying you have to be so good with the timing. I mean, look at this again. Like you have to hop just as about to hit. And here's the second one coming around the corner, power sliding, uh, going through, and boom, another successful dodge. So that's two in a row. Like I, I had to capture that in the replay because I'm like, yo, this is greatness. Greatness needs to be recorded. <laughs> this is me on the beach with Bowser again, and boom, another blue shell dodge. And this last clip here is not a blue shell dodge, but I had to just record this because um, when I was playing this game, what was happening was, you know, um, I'm in second place for quite some time, you know what I mean? I'm blazing through, um, it's like Waluigi, and I think it was, um, yeah, Luigi in front of me, right? 
and I'm doing everything to get in front of him. I'm power sliding, I'm hitting him with red shells, I'm getting hit with red shells, and I mean, it's just like neck and neck. You know, so I'm in first place and I'm like, yeah. Then I bounce into something and I'm like, no, I'm in second place. There's no way right now I can potentially win this race at all. You know what I mean? I can't pause slide. We're almost at the finish line. And then I get a green shell and just as we reach there, boom, I hit him and take first place. So yeah, greatness has been televised. <laughs> So there you have it, this is me successfully dodging the blue shell on multiple instances, no, on multiple occasions. Either way, boom.